Hello everyone, welcome back. Let us study, up, study about classification of element. Elements are classified into three types that is metal, non-metals and metalloids. Metals An element that shows property of malleability, ductility, lustrous, nature, density, high density, stiffness or hardness, mechanical strength, high melting and boiling point, sonority and good conductor of electricity are considered as metal. Whereas such element that is neither malleable nor ductile does not conduct electricity, it is brittle, non-sonorous, such elements are considered as non-metals. And metalloids the elements which possess some properties of metal and some properties of non-metals are called metalloids. Some of the examples of metals that is aluminium, iron, gold, silver whereas when we are talking about few examples of non-metals that is carbon, bromine, hydrogen, chlorine etc. And metalloids include some very important example such as silicone, arsenic, antimony, germanium, bismuth etc. Since the characteristics of both metals and non-metals are present in metalloids, they are also known as semi-metal or semi-conductor because they look like metals but are brittle like non-metals. They are neither good conductor of electricity and nor insulator. That's why they are also called semiconductor. We talk about few examples of metalloids. Now, if we are talking about few exceptions in case of metal and non-metal which we discuss, that is, we talk that metals are stiff, hard, except few alkali metals, all metals are hard. Only mercury is liquid at room temperature, rest all metals are solid. Only few metals show the properties that they could be soft. They could be, there could be the possibility to cut them with the help of knife. If we are talking about non-metals, we talk that non-metals are brittle. Except diamond, all non-metals are soft. Only diamond is non-metal which is very hard. We talk about physical state. Physically all metals are solid at room temperature except, except mercury. Whereas non-metals are either solid or gases at room temperature except bromine which is liquid at room temperature. Now let us study about our next topic that is compound. What is compound? Compound are those pure chemical substances which are formed by the combination of two or more elements in a fixed proportion by mass. The compounds are formed by chemical change. They are made up of molecules that is their representing units are molecules which are the combination of two or more different atoms in fixed ratio.